in big games like the one against the Indianapolis Colts where you have to put the team on your back a little bit and find a way to win, do you enjoy that almost a little bit more because you're the guy running the offense on the field? Yeah, it's fun. You know, I mean, anytime you get in a critical situation, those are the moments you dream about from the time you're a kid uh, until now. You know, you lay in bed and, and you picture, well, it's a two minute drive to go tie it up in Seattle or you know, a four minute drive to, to put the game to a two score game this week against Indy. It's something you dream about and you relish those moments. Play fake Tannehill rolling right, looking, could run it. 45, 50, 45, 40, 35, and he's taken down at the 32 yard line. What a run, Ryan Tannehill. We've seen you run a lot. This is a thing that you do. And when you take off running, you don't seem to be into the slide part of a quarterback <laughs> taking off on a run. Why is that? I just try to pick my spots. You know, I think there's definitely times to slide and I try to get down. If it's gonna be a collision, there's multiple guys that are gonna, gonna hit me. But, uh, you know, sometimes I feel like I can get on an edge and it's not gonna be a big hit. You know, if the guy's trying to arm tackle me and I'm fall for it for another three yards, then, you know, as long as I'm not taking a big hit, I don't think it's a big deal. I would assume that Mike Vrabel has some thoughts about that. <laughs> yeah, yeah, he wants me to slide. You know, he just doesn't want me to take a big hit. You know, at the end of the day, and I don't either, I don't, I don't want to take a big hit. So I try to be smart with it. You know, not put myself in a position to, to be injured, you know, take a, take a big hit. But, you know, there are certain situations where, you know, slide is not necessary. We've seen this Titans offense through three weeks now. What do you like about this offense the most? I think we're heading in the right direction. Kind of stacking some good plays, some good sequences, some good possessions, and, uh, and building our confidence. You know, I think that sometimes it takes a little bit of a time to get into a groove as an offense. We understand how we want to play the game, and, and guys are really starting to, to come together and play as a unit. Now let's flip that around. In the first three weeks, where have you seen areas of improvement on this Titans offense? Obviously, we didn't come out and play well the, the first first week at all. You know, first game at home was, was tough. We didn't get it going early. You know, we're able to score, but then weren't able to, to keep pushing the ball down the field. So uh, it was tough. Second week, you know, we were able to push the ball down the field, move up and down the field, and weren't scoring when we got in the red zone. This week, we moved the ball really well, but had turnovers. So there's been something a little different every game, but uh, I think that the guys are, are buying in on, on getting the, the things fixed that we need to get fixed, and uh, hopefully we can do that moving forward. Through the first three weeks, you've completed passes to 11, 11 different guys <laughs> on offense. How good does that make you feel heading into October football when you're going to have to continue to make those plays no matter what? Yeah, it just shows the depth of our team and the confidence that we have that no matter who's in there, that uh, if they're open, I'll, I'll throw them the ball. You know, I don't really care who's in there as long as they find a way to get open, then uh, I feel confident throwing them the football. Now you've played the Jets five different times at the Meadowlands in your career. As a guy who's been there a couple times, do you have tidbits or advice? You're kind of a local when it comes to <laughs> playing at the Meadowlands. Yeah, I don't know. It's a, it's a fun place to play, no doubt about it. It's a really cool stadium. Atmosphere is really, really cool. I'm sure we'll get the, the J-E-T-S, Jets, Jets, Jets. I'm sure Fireman Ed will have that going. But uh, yeah, it's a, it's a really cool place to play.